What's up guys, Solar here from Pixtuts. So they just released online the CM10 uh, build. It's very un uh, very early build for um, your touchpad. So this is one that I've installed, uh, you know, all of all of the versions that they've had. So anyway, I'm just going to go ahead and into the SD card, drag the CM10 file, which is available in the XDA developers form. And I have that going. I also have the Google Apps uh, file for it as well, which is located right there. And I dragged it into the, the touchpad as well. So we're looking at two different bars here. All right. So every uh, everything is loaded onto the touchpad. So what I'm gonna do is gonna hold on the power button here and press reboot into recovery and press OK and just waiting for this to go through okay so what we're gonna do is install zip from SD card like the usual stuff and choose zip and then I down here did CM10 right there press the power the home button actually go down to the only yes option and then press enter and now it is installing it all right, so the CM10 is install is taking a lot longer than the usual CM9s. Okay, that's done. So we're also going to install the uh, the new uh, Jelly Bean. Now uh, you guys can quickly see along the different files I have, you will see the three different Google applications. Uh, one is for gingerbread, ice cream sandwich, and then Jelly Bean. So if you ever have multiple, just click the Jelly Bean one and install it. It says Google Apps for Android 4.1.1 as of July 26th install from SD card complete for whatever reason it still says uh, Cyanogen Mod 9 uh, usually it says that it's installing uh, you know making the modifications optimizing apps or such and it might have not worked on for me but uh, you guys can definitely try it on your device and then see if it uh, works or not and then post it in the comments or make a response video of course I'll accept it so let's check the installation out here it does in fact say that Android is upgrading. Something to note uh, while this thing is upgrading is that this is um, CM10. Of course, there's no Android build that is official from HP, of course, because it doesn't exist anymore from the WebOS team for a uh, HP touchpad. But of course, this device is more used with the Android operating system and mostly to the Cyanogen mod team. And their most anticipated build is Cyanogen 10, which will be the Jelly Bean install for your touchpad or many other devices that they do uh, support. Uh, however, the build that I install right now is the unofficial CM10. So this is morally, more so the unofficial, unofficial uh, build for the uh, touchpad here. So let's see how it goes. All right. So it, doesn't, it looks like nothing has changed. Let's slide in. Oh, I did see a small little thing that, uh, characters, okay, so put your favorite apps here, blah, blah, so here it is, it's buggy, kind of slow, do you do see that the, this, uh, microphone button has enlarged, microphone does not work, all that you guys just saw, there is Google now, see it doesn't work, and apps, you got all the apps that you uh, installed before. The timing format has changed. Settings bar moved to the right, just like they showed the your network connection. And there's there's boxes made for the uh, different running apps and notifications. All right, guys. So here is Jelly Bean, the unofficial CM10 build for HP Touchpad. So long here for big sets. More Touchpad videos, instant updates. Subscribe. Sorry for me. That's peace out, guys.